Mukbang? Mukbang? <laughs> We're gonna eat some food. <laughs> Hey everyone, what's up? My name is Brittany, my friends call me Bolts, and welcome back to another Vlogmas video. So today is gonna be my very first mukbang. I hope that's how you say it. And we're gonna talk about my top songs of 2019. I would love to play the songs for you and dance to them, but this is just how it's gonna be, so that's fine. I thought we'd just do a mukbang and I'll talk about some of my top songs, any of the artists that I might have seen live this year. I actually have not eaten McDonald's since I moved to Los Angeles. Now, if you know me at all, you would know that I love McDonald's. I love McDonald's so much. I've even had multiple birthdays there when I was like three or four. So I love McDonald's no matter how much into fitness I am, I love it. So I've really been missing it and I thought that it might be time to treat myself. Mm. So this is what I order every time I go to McDonald's. A large fry, always, always, always. I usually get a number two, but I actually ordered this on Postmates and they didn't have those options. So I just got a double cheeseburger. Usually number two is just two regular cheeseburgers, so I got a double. And then I got an apple pie, which I'm still so salty about this. It's been years, but Where's my cherry pie? Cherry was the best flavor, and now all I'm stuck with is apple. I guess I'm gonna eat it because that's the only option you have, but bring back cherry pie, please. Please, for the love of God. Last but not least, a Dr. Pepper. I always order Dr. Pepper when I go to McDonald's. It's honestly one of the only sodas I even like to drink, which I don't drink soda very often, but what I do is Dr. Pepper. I've eaten this meal so many times. So many times. I acquired Stella in a McDonald's parking lot. I didn't birth her, but I acquired her. If you guys remember my OGs, you will remember the story of how I adopted my dog, Stella. I bought her in a parking lot, a McDonald's parking lot. Come here, let me get in the video. So Stella loves McDonald's too. Go away. Oh, this is comforting. Like I said, I haven't had this in so long. My last apartment in Boise before I left was next door to a McDonald's. I would smell McDonald's. I All I would crave was McDonald's. And then I went and ate McDonald's. I miss home. I'm excited to go back, but I'm nervous. See how it goes. I always got to eat like some of the fries first. All right, let's get into the Spotify business. I'm excited to talk about this and I've been wanting to post about it, but honestly, I wanted to make a video about it first. Take a look. All the seasons. Post Malone was my top artist. He's been my top artist the past two years. <laughs> Flume. I've seen Flume live multiple times. 
I listen to some really good dance music. What is this? Doing Time by Lana Del Rey. I love this song by No Cyrus. I honestly was not a fan of hers. Oh, I love this song too. I don't know if this will all count as copyright, but I figure since I'm talking over it, well, guess we'll find out. <clears throat> Anyways, I thought that I would share that with you guys, and I'll link it down below too so that you can see the whole playlist, but my top songs were like, Wow, Ball For Me, but both by Post Malone. Shake It Up by Trippy Red, Colorblind by Diplo, Sicko Mode, I listen to a lot of Travis Scott. A lot of Skrillex. Would You Ever is one of my top songs. Where the Wild Things Are by Zed's Dead and Millennium. Bad Guy by Billie Eilish. I listen to a lot of Cascade because I saw Cascade and Skrillex both at Paradiso. Oh my god. Amazing. This year was so amazing. I went to so many great festivals. Blessed. Never Let You Go. I listened to a lot of Sunburn. I saw Sunburn at Hangout. A lot of Tame Impala. The less I know, the better. Um, The Suburbs by Mr. Little Jeans. That song has me in my feelings. I listened to that the whole time I was driving to California when I moved. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is one of my favorite songs. Marge Simpson by Daddy Mac and Tree Time. <laughs> I want to play these. Whip a Tesla by Young Gravy. Truth Hurts, of course. That was like everyone's top song by Lizzo. I Miss the Old You, a lot of Black Bear. Fuck It, I Love You by Lana Del Rey. Love that song. Worry No More, The Keys and Crates remix by Diplo, Little Yachty. Hot Girl Bummer. Losing It by Fisher. That was like one of the top house songs this year. Fantastic by Flume. Designs for You by Phantoms. How Bizarre by OMC. Drew Barrymore by Bryce Vine. Running Miles by Hippie Sabotage, yes. A lot of Tyga. Girls Have Fun. Mm. Nothing's Gonna Hurt You Baby by Cigarettes After Sex. I had a very sad summer. I listened to that a lot. Anyways. Those are some of my top artists. If you've been following me for a while, you know that music is my life. I've been to so many music festivals and it has honestly just made me really cherish life and cherish the moments that I have so I'm hoping that 2020 will bring a lot more music festivals I want to go to Hangout 2020 so bad like the lineup is incredible I wanted to kind of treat myself because I've just really been evaluating where I want to be in 2020 and I guess I'm kind of putting together like my New Year's resolutions but I want to start before then. Every year I make it a goal of mine to start earlier, start ahead of everybody else. Right now I'm just kind of purging before the holidays because I'm really trying to get it right. I'm trying to get more into fitness, go to the gym more. It's really really hard going to the gym here. <laughs> I say as I have a freaking double cheeseburger in my hand. I hate myself. I hate myself even more that I'm filming this. Mm. It makes my heart sing. It, it's like crack. It's like immediate crack. Go away. Go, go on the floor. She's just sitting there like, when are you going to give me a bite? Mm. Fire. 
I never loved the Max that had like the lettuce and onion and all that stuff on it. I mean, I'll eat a cheeseburger if you give it to me, but. Also comment below if you agree that McDonald's ketchup tastes way different than regular ketchup. It's gotta have more like sugar in it. Sometimes I kind of have to like eat a little bit of each thing and then revisit an item. So, I need this apple pie. All right, you guys, well, my camera battery is of course flashing. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and watching me eat some junk food. I love you guys and don't forget to follow me at Brittany Bull on Instagram and Snapchat. Bye.